Hi guys. So today, my battery's dying on my box. Yes, you've guessed it. Today we're going to do the occult box. But I like to set the mood, guys. I have actually got the witch's incense burning, guys. It is absolutely amazing. So guys, if we're ready, we are going to start the occult box unboxing. See you in a jiffy. Hi guys, welcome back to Enigma 77 Reviews. So today, yes, the long awaited occult mystery boxes have arrived today. And it's Saturday guys. So yeah, so today the mystery boxes have arrived. I have ordered quite a lot from Occult. Um, as you know, I have now stopped my beauty subscription boxes and I've gone into the dark side. But guys, I've always been alternative. It's nothing new. I just thought that the way forward was like doing beauty. I never knew there was such thing as this kind of boxes out there. And do you know what? I'm super, super stoked that I found this kind of boxes. As you know, I've got a lot of occult boxes coming. I do have spooky box and I do have trick or treat. I am trying to decide which one is going to be here to stay. Um, I would like to keep all three, but realistically, I don't think I can afford to. I quite like the look of a cult box and I like the look of the trick or treat box. Spooky box is hit and miss for me. I have seen a lot of unboxings. Not too sure if that's where I want to go, but let's get stuck in guys. So these have arrived today. I have waited a little bit, but that's perfectly fine though. I was made aware that I, I would have been waiting a while. And for that reason, I'm really, really not bothered. So guys, what can I find? Okay, so I have one occult box. I have one occult bag. And I have my invoice, which is in front of me. So I can refer back to that. So on this bag, guys, I love the little stickers that they put on there. It's a shame to rip them. It's the only way to get in it. So let's start with this box, guys. My battery's quite low. So I may end up just doing this one and we'll come back and do the other one. So first thing I can see is the occult bag. Now I know I pay £5 for this one, guys. I'm just testing to see what it's like. With a cult box, you do get to pick your preference to things that you like. For example, I have told them so many times that I don't like spiders and I don't like moths. That's just my fear factor. Um, not so much like I don't like, I don't like them. Let's be honest, I don't like them. I do like gothy kind of alternative things. The spectrum is quite high on that one. I do like everything to do with metal. Uh, as for the witches kind of side, I've never really ventured into that kind of alternativeness. Um, and I think I'm maybe too old for that now. I do like dream catchers and stuff like that and crystals. So who knows? So that's the bag, guys. I'm going to open the bag first and then we'll go to the box. Now, this was £5. Beautiful little sticker that they put on here. I have seen um, Mama Goth and I think I've seen um, Luna Lily. I've, I've seen a few people do the unboxings. And I was quite intrigued. Now, I'm going to try and peel this off and then just put it here because today it's all about a coat box. So, little sticker there. I am wearing my Boohoo school t shirt. So, guys, first things first. Excited! Yes! Okay, so here we go. First thing I can see is this a little occult box emporium. So, I have gone into the emporium. I have also subscribed as well so that's not arrived yet that probably come in october and i do have the halloween special box coming as well that'll be october so be sure to subscribe to my channel to see them boxes in october although i am going in hospital next week so it may be um, a little late but we'll soon get it up guys so it says here www.occultboxemporium.co.uk so if that's where you want to go guys i will link everything below and it has home decor accessories, jewellery and lots more. An electric range of gothic and occult products. Instagram at Occult Emporium. So 10% off guys when you spend £20 or more in store. Applying the code Emporium10 at checkout. So I will put all this information on below. Take advantage of the 10%. I did. I think I used Mama Goff's 10% and um, thanks for that Jules. So with that said, I will put all the information but I'll keep that there. 
We also have this other one. It's beautiful, dark and gothy. I kind of like the look of what she's holding. What's she holding? Can't quite see. Oh, she's holding one of the big, big mystery boxes. Next year, I'll probably invest in one of them. So it says occult box, www.occultbox.co.uk. So they are on Facebook, guys. It's www.facebook.com slash occult box. They're also on Instagram, which I've just said. And you've also got inquiries at occultmysterybox.co.uk. It says, say, 15% on orders over £20. Apply code mystery15. So if you do want that code, I'll pop that down below as well, guys. Or if you're not sure, or if you want more information, just give me a little message down in the description box and I'll get back to you. Right, guys, with that said, here is my little £5 bag. Already I can see something I really, really like. Let me just put this here. Quite a nice little bag, that. Reminds me of when I used to go and get my penny sweets at the corner shop. Oh, what have I just dropped? Oh, bugger me. I have dropped my badge. Two minutes, guys. Right, so there's a little boo on there. A little ghosty that says boo. <laughs> I love it. I'll stick that on something. I have got a gothic unit upstairs, and I stick all kinds of things like that on it, so I'll probably put on there. Thank you, Occult Box. So first thing I'm grabbing, and you know I'm going to grab, is this. And I haven't got my glasses on. I really didn't want to pull them on, but I'm blind as a bloody bat. So this one says... I can't read it, guys. I My eyesight's terrible. Let's see what it says. La Femme lipstick. Oh, my God, look at the colour of that. So, guys, I did put makeup as a preference because I do like my gothy kind of makeup. As you know, I started my channel off on wigs and beauty. <gasps> black as black. Guys, that is even blacker than what I've got on. What I've got on is like a charcoal grey. But I'm going to try this. <gasps> oh, my Lord. So guys, I used to have a lot of black lipsticks and I had to get rid of her. Oh my lord, that is nice. Application guys, it is really, really creamy. <gasps> uh. That is amazing. Absolutely love that. Thank you, Colt. So that's number 43 and it's ebony. Um, I'll pop all the information on below and what was in there so you get to know just in case you don't understand my northern accent So that's my first item Absolutely made up with that um, And I'm happy 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 uh, Yeah, so first thing the second thing sorry is the shush spell casting in progress. This is a fridge magnet I actually collect fridge magnets and um, Zach seems to get his hands on him and breaks them all So hopefully now he won't break this one and I kind of love that. Look at that. And it's like one of them bendy hard... This is hard wearing. So, Zach, if you're going to break this, it won't break. It won't smash. So, that's my second item. And I love it, love it, love it. Um, I don't think I've got anything magnetised in my room. Because I'd like to keep things like this in my studio. But I don't think I've got anything on there. But I will keep that separate. <gasps> yes! my first purple spelly candle and it's purple so they do ask for your color preference i did tell them purple black and red i do like purple i love purple i do love red a lot of my living room is black and red and my my bedroom used to be all purple now it's gray and black and white because it's all like skulls but that is my third item thank you guys for that i do have a little holder that fits these in that i can put it in but i'm going to collect these for now Guys, you get quite a lot in your box for a fiver. I've got to tell you, I'm really chuffed. So I've got an occult badge, which is great because I could stick that on my little jacket. I do have an EMP gothic coat where I do stick things like this on. So I'll keep that for there. Plus you get to advertise a cult box at the same time. So it's a win-win. <laughs> so we've got a little organza bag. How cute is that bag? Oh, God. And I can see a Mr. Ghosty in here. Oh, that's well cute. So it's a little little ghosty and it's like like hard plastic. You don't bend or anything, guys, but that is amazing. It's like chunky confetti kind of thing. I like that. So I'll just put that there and it's quite a happy little ghosty. Oh, so we. I thought the, the ghosty was the necklace. It actually isn't. OMG. OMG. Is there two necklaces in here? Oh my God, there is. Well, blow me down. Oh, this one's got a little bit tangled. I don't want to pull it in case it thing is. I will have to denot it somehow. 
But guys, I'm going to do that after. But as you can see, it is a tiny little moon. Oh, I love that. I know my friend, Alicia, the moon and stars. She will absolutely love this. She does a spooky box. But um, I think she's going to wait and see what the occult box is like. And maybe dive into the dark side with me. So that's that, guys. It is knotted, but it's not a problem. Because my husband can unknot them in a second. So that's my first necklace. I think it's just got tangled up with this one. And then that one's ended up knotted. <gasps> Look at this so this one is a dagger it looks like the design on it my eyesight is really bad guys so i can't really see unless i put the glasses on like celtic design on top of the dagger i absolutely love that now guys they do know that i'm allergic to certain metals um pewter so to speak so they'll know what materials has got pewter in um i've had this on now guys for about five days and i've not had any rash so this is perfectly fine and I have got my River Island skull as well, and that never irritates me. So it's only certain metals, guys, that I've got pewter in. So that is absolutely brilliant. So two necklaces. Wow. And I love the organza bags, guys. So you've got an extra large one, and you've got a dinner baby one, because that's fab. So I've got a little wooden skull here. I'd seen things like this the other day in Hobbycraft, and I was really like, mm, do I buy some? So I love that. Thank you, guys. I'll keep all these safe. I've got a little, looks like... Not so much a zombie boy, but maybe he wants to be a zombie boy. My little boy will love this. Look at that. And he's wearing a little all-in-one scully kind of onesie. <laughs> so that's that. And then we've got a little cap. These are good. It must take him ages to make these little things. And that's that. So that is absolutely amazing. I like that, guys. So that is my first occult bag which obviously is five pounds so guys you get quite a lot in your box in your bag for five pounds i do have another box guys but i'm going to do that in another video because i think we want to concentrate on this this is my 10 pound mystery box guys i thought let's try a mystery box as well bit of if i get to try them all i get an indication of what's in each so again you've got this lovely occult tag i have seen what these bo these boxes look like and it's got like the pentagram the moon and the, the stars kind of thing on there and it's got this beautiful ribbon which I save all my ribbons when I did the beauty boxes I saved the ribbons and the packaging because they just do come in handy guys so I'm just going to slide that off because I don't want to cut it and this is the size of the £10 box guys so it's a fair size I definitely I mean it's bigger than the um, birch box beauty box so yeah fantastic so guys I think it is sellotape, yes it is. Let me just get my tweezers along and break that. And I hope you guys can see okay. If not, I will put my big light on. So guys, what do we see? Oh yes, okay, so black rose petals. I have loads of these upstairs. I have purple and black because when I got married, um, my theme was dark chocolate purple. Uh, chocolate purple Cadbury's purple <laughs> so we had loads of these along the table in black and in purple so thanks for that guys here we go we have an occult box and the other side of it is here it says five pound off mystery boxes over the price of 30 pound enter code hex five i think it is at checkout so i will put this code on below guys you've got lots of um codes there to take advantage of very very uh, very giving and i think that's absolutely great you don't really get a lot of that in beauty boxes so <gasps> omg guys oh no dropped it then so i can see one thing straight away that i'm absolutely dying to get my hands on try not to swear because um i have got a potty mouth guys but for the purpose of this video <laughs> so excited right first things first and i'll talk about this so oh I collect these, so I've seen these before because I have, I think, about six or seven in my drawer. As you know, I'm a nail technician at trade. Don't do it anymore. I quit. I retired. But you never forget. So this is a purple. I don't have purple. Mr. Scully. This is the actual lid, but it looks like he's got a hat. There you go. And it's a beautiful purple. Look at that, guys. I am a biter, but I still nail at... Um, nails so this is brilliant just because i ain't got no nails it doesn't mean i can't put some false ones on and decorate them oh my lord that purple is amazing 
a coat box. I love you. <laughs> this is brilliant. So my second kind of makeup. I absolutely love it. I shouldn't really paint it all that because I'm going to smudge it now. So first item is that Misty Scully. Absolutely love it. I have noticed this as well. So guys, anybody who knows me knows that I collect skulls and gothic fairies. I do have like four glass cabinets full of Anne Stokes and Nemesis. And upstairs I have a whole unit of skulls, Nemesis, all kinds of things. So this is absolutely perfect. I will not burn this, guys. Gotta tell you. He will go up on my unit and if I do get any more, I'm just going to collect them all. So I love tea lights, guys. I burn them constantly. But this little chap ain't going to get burned. He's another Mr. Scully. So that's my second item. Already I'm blown away by this box. Oh, oh, <laughs> so Mr. Ghosty is holding my lollipop. Look at how cute that is. And it's a purple and black lollipop. I love lollipops, guys. I have lost some weight. I've had, I think I've lost three stone and all. But every now and again, it's nice to have a bit of a treat. And I'm chubba chubba lolly mad. So I can't wait to try this one, guys. So, ooh. It says happy Halloween at the bottom as well, guys. So I'm going to keep that there. So that's my third item there. Oh, God. I can't believe it. So I know what this is because I, I think I've seen Mama Goff open it on hers or somebody else. It says Zombie Nights Max Volume Double Intensity Mascara. Yay. So he's got Mrs. Scully Head. Absolutely love it. I've never had any of these ones, guys. So this one's totally new to me. Let's just pull them out. Oh look at that brush let me just put that there can you see that let me just see if it grips my because i'm growing my eyelashes i'm using a serum at the minute and they're growing oh, oh my god that latches onto the lashes perfectly better than some of the bloody la um, mascaras i've been using in the beauty boxes that is amazing cult box thank you this is fab i feel like christmas so that is that one guys Perfect. I'll tell you if it wasn't so good, and I can tell you that that's latched onto my eyelashes perfectly. So that's one, two, three, four, four items. I've got a, a patch. I can't remember what it's called, this. I've seen this symbol before. Hope you comment on below if you know, but I do like this. Is that supposed to be the eye in the middle of the heart? There's a name for this. Now, I'm not too sure if this is an eye on patch or you peel it and it sticks. Yeah, you peel it. So it peels, guys, and it sticks, I think. Or no. A cut box, tell me am I doing this wrong, I'm not going to wreck it. But other than that, you'd probably iron it and they'll stick on. Uh, I did have a, a cut off denim jacket that had all my band patches on. Um, when I found out I was um, disabled and I can't headbang anymore, I, I kind of went on a downer and I kind of sold a lot of my gothy stuff out of temper. And now I'm trying to regain it all back and I'm kind of gutted I did that now because this would have looked perfect on my jacket. So let's try and start again. So that is that guys, thank you very much. A little organza bag or ganza bag here with something in it. These boxes are amazing. I'm quite um, chuffed by this. And I still have another box down there. I can't even remember which box that is. So, guys, let me just try. It's actually wrapped around my badge. Let me just see if I can release it. It's just hooked round. How the hell have I done that? How am I going to get that off? Right, guys. I'll do it in a minute because it's time. It's stuck underneath. It's kind of locked on. But the badge says, stay spooky. Don't you worry, guys. I'll always stay spooky. And let me just show you. Oh, I've got one of these. I wanted one of these. So this is a tiny little bat. Oh, my God. I've got three necklaces already. Is that the right way, guys? Or am I doing it the wrong way? There we go. It's a tiny little bat. And if I just turn him around so you get to see him all the way around... There you go. It is absolutely cute. I love it. So I've got three necklaces so far, guys. And do you know what? I don't care because I've seen um, Killstar doing a necklace holder. I'm going to grab it. Oh, there's too much stuff in here. I can't believe this. So guys, I've got a pentagram. It looks like a headscarf. And this is perfect because I used to always wear headscarves. I can't quite remember now how they went. I think the triangular one, weren't it? So it goes like this, guys then you kind of tie it and then it goes underneath and then you tie it like so <gasps> i love it absolutely love it thank you i love it and it's got a pentagram on it guys this is amazing and i will wear this guys i used to always wear head scarves um i've even got a spiral direct hat that i wear with red roses on it 
fantastic. I need to get my breath back. I'm so bloody excited. And then, woo, yes. So I have coasters on my table because I've got a big glass table here. And I've got my bullet for my Valentine um, coasters on here because I don't like putting cups on there. But check out this coaster. It's a Mr. Scully coaster. I may put him in my bedroom and put him on my unit because I do like, when I'm poorly and I do go up to bed and, and take my iPad up, this would be brilliant to put my cups on. I've lost count how many goods there is, but let's just say there's plenty in here. Woo, I got another um, fridge magnet and it says kitchen witch. That sounds about right. I'm, I kind of get told I'm a bit of a witch. Um, my dad calls me a, a witch and I won't say what else because uh, he says I'm quite moody. Um, I don't think I'm moody, but apparently I am. So must be when there's a full moon, I get a bit moody because they do say when it's full moon, I get really... Rrr. So, but guys, don't worry, I'll never be guru with you. I'll stay on my stay on my good side. So that is that one, guys. I've kept my little organza bag, so I think they're amazing. <gasps> and my husband will appreciate this. I don't drive, but my husband does. We drive um, an ambulance. Yes, we have an ambulance and we converted it into a motorhome because our son's autistic and we had to make it up for him. So this is a mystical earth freshener and it's cherry scented and it's a, a placard. Look at that, guys. And it says talking board. Oh, I love it. Absolutely love it. So guys, next year I am going to be diving into a lot of things. So if you want to see all that, you need to be subscribed to my channel and um, all good things to come. So that is great, guys. So that's, let's count. So that's one. And that, can I say, guys, these are well packed as well. So a cult box, you do yourself proud. This is amazing. So that's one, two, the necklace, three, the badge, four, mascara, five. Mr. Scully, six, the um, fridge magnet, six, seven, lollipop, eight, Mr. Scully, nail varnish, nine, my cup, that's my little bag that came in that, then I got the coaster, ten, and then I got the, the badge to go on your denim jacket or what have you, or a t-shirt, eleven, and did I say my necklace as well? 12. I think I've got 12 items in here all in all, guys, because I've got my little back necklace as well. Absolutely fantastic. I am so happy right now. So that is the two boxes. Now, I paid 15 in total for this, guys. So these are the first ones that I ordered. I got the £10 box and I got the £5 organza bag. I'm quite happy of what I... Not quite happy. I'm extremely happy with what I've got so far. I'm dying to see what's in that one. I think that one's a £20 box. But we're going to wrap this up, guys. I'll come back. I'm going to put the lights on a little bit brighter because I don't know if you all got to see that properly. Hopefully you did. If not, I'll come back online again and redo it for you. All right, guys. Thank you for watching. Pop your comments on below. I will put all the codes on. Go and take advantage, guys. It's absolutely worth it. And um, I can say one thing. It's been worth the wait. So stay spooky, guys. And um, can I just say that witches... Um, Incense stick is absolutely amazing. It smells gorgeous in here. It reminds me of when you walk into the gothic alternative shops, that smell. Absolutely amazing. Right, guys, my battery's quite low, so I'm going to go and have to charge it for an hour. But uh, we'll come back and we'll get the second occult box done. So make sure you stay tuned for that one. Take care and I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.